It's time for Food Adventure Program for Awesome People, the Japanese Treasure Edition. Okay, so for those of you that don't know, we recently went to Japan, and when we were there, of course we had to pick up some candy and chips and junk food that we could try out. Obviously. And you know what's funny is every time you go to Japan, you think to yourself, you know, it's just a stereotype mm. that you're gonna find the weird stuff there. Like Japan's not like you know, that. Nah. And then we walk into the local convenience store and we find like Mountain Dew flavored chips. Which is the first thing that we're gonna try in today's expedition. Okay, we don't even know if this is the chips or what are they? Why does Mountain Dew make food? And is this gonna taste like decreased sperm count? Oh yeah, I remember those rumors going around. Yeah, when we you were drink kids. Mountain Dew and then you'll never have babies That's again. That's right. What do they look like? Oh my God, it smells like Mountain it Dew. That is so like disgusting. This is gonna be gross. Oh my God, it smells like someone took Mountain Dew and poured it into a cup of Cheetos. Can you guys see the oh inside man. of this? This is not gonna Look be fun. Look at all the little sugar crystals on the okay, edges. Grab it. Okay, ready? Wait, we gotta put a bunch in our mouth so we can suffer together. How about a, why? You're such a big mouth. I'm taking like two of them. No, you gotta put in a lot so you can like fully experience it. One is not gonna be I will enough. experience it with two. Three, two, Come one. On. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Intern Lee, I'm very sorry, but when you clean the garbage today, you're going to find some nuts. Ugh. My God, I can't even speak. I can taste the mint in the background. It tastes like burning rotten cereal. Okay, no, you know what it tastes like? I mean, you bite into a Fruit Loop, it has like that fruity, tense flavor. Jesus. It tasted like a, a Fruit Loop at first, and then suddenly the taste of lemon, lime, Mountain Dew hits you, and it's covered in like sugar crystals that like pop or okay. something weird. I'm not sure if, th this isn't a common experience a lot of people have, but I remember when I was working at a, a drugstore, whenever something was broken on the shelf, we took it to the back and then we could eat it. So for example, there's like a, a broken bag of Doritos, like if it popped open, then we could eat Doritos. I'm sure no one abused that policy. <laughs> Anyhow, what they wound up having was once I saw some juice boxes and I'm like, oh my God, can I have one of these juice boxes? And the manager was like, sure you can have the juice box. And I drank it and it was like six months rotten and it just tasted like fruity burning like in my mouth. Like fermented disgustingness? Like fermented nasty fruit. Did you just have a flashback? When this you like is that? exactly what it tasted like, like fermented fruit burning. You Mountain Dew, you have no right <laughs> to make food. No rights! It smells like it tastes, but you know what we should definitely bring into this? Susie! Susie, you wanna Susie. try some really awesome chips? I kinda saw Simon put them. <laughs> Because, what? No, because Simon put like nine of them in his mouth and they actually sparkle. No, I don't wanna do this to Susie. Susie, no, 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 Susie, these are terrible. Susie, just have one. This, For science. This is probably the worst thing I've ever eaten in my life when it comes to a snack. Wow. You taste the sparkling? It like Mountain Dew, but it's like in the most possible worst. Like, <laughs> yes. The worst, the worst oh, format. I don't imagine why you would want to make a savory Every food out of Mountain Dew. Okay, so that's a big no. Worst thing ever. <laughs> <laughs> ever. We should save some for Lee. Time for redemption. We have a new flavor of Pringles that we don't exactly know what flavor they are because we can't read Japanese. But from what I could see, there's a volcano that has erupted, magma cheese, and is coming down on a path of destruction. And these two Pringles, who realize that there's no escaping the island, have decided to commit suicide with their ties by strangling themselves. But they're wearing scarves. And I thought these okay, were chicken suicide. drumsticks. Those look like Pringles. Are those drumsticks? I thought they were chicken drumsticks. No, look at that. Chicken drumsticks don't curl like that. I I thought this was these like are chicken Pringles drumstick. that have come to die. Okay, I don't in know what my these mouth. are. Wait, wait, what does it say in Japanese on the outside? Pringles. <laughs> I can't even open these. You got my nails in? I can't even open no, them. No, I just can't open them because I'm not good at opening these. Take a smell first. Okay, it smells mm. like chicken. Tastes like it smells like chicken. It smells like mustard to me. Okay, ready? Six at a time. You got to do a lot at once. You're welcome to do a lot at this once. Is how we're supposed That's to not do how things. I consume my food. I consume one at a time. I am not a barbarian, with Rocky Man Warrior. Three, two, one. What? flavor is this? I taste something mustardy, vinegary. I have no guess, guys. All I know is that this is the most delicious thing because it got rid of that foul taste of Mountain Dew from my mouth. Side note about these Pringles, these are the kind of Pringles that I'm used to, longer and thinner, and they snap more. Like North American style Pringles, mm. while the cream Pringles are like short and stubbly and dense. Uh, I'm satisfied. 
Are you gonna eat like 25 more of them? I need to get all that Mountain Dew out of my mouth. It tastes like a muted ranch. Yeah. I think it definitely tastes like some kind of cheese. Maybe this is supposed to be fondue flavor. Almost like it's trying to get out of Swiss cheese. Like that kind of like vinegary, cheesy flavor. I don't know what this is. It actually tastes quite good. I've been looking forward to this one. It is a look bar and it's strawberry jello versus strawberry vanilla shortcake, I think. It looks like there's two different flavors happening here at once. I don't know what this is. I've just created Packaging chaos is here. Crazy. Okay, here we go. It even has a resealable hole as if people eat part of their How many people reseal their single serving chocolate bar? Like all the chocolate bar. No, mm -hmm. when you eat a but chocolate imagine. bar, you eat it all in like one shot. Well, I don't know about that. Take this out. Oh, this is so cool. It says, look, look, look. look. Or cool. How or many letters can we get out of this? Or okay, lo. <laughs> Or Olo. That's not a word. Olo, yeah, this is an Olo clip. I'm just called an Olo clip. Or it says, Ooh. Or it says, Kook. Or it says, Lol. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's eat one. Okay, we're just like, we should cut it in half with our teeth so we can tell the, the flavor. We just eat it. Okay. I got the pink one. Me too. Yeah. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. Did you just clear out half these chocolates like a huge piggy? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna put this over here. This is actually the best thing we ate so far. Okay, the diagram on the back that lets you know which color is which color makes it seem like the piece is like an inch wide. Half a centimeter wide. Mm -hmm. But there is a clear difference because I just had one of the oh. white ones. Who would you like better? Which one? one I like one. the white one. And it's creamier taste. I also like the white one better, but it's actually really cool because the inside's very creamy mm -hmm. and then they have like a, a burst of jelly or something like that. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. No! Hi, bye, Bo. No! Why? No, no! Black camera, no. you said they're gonna win. I'm not playing at all. No! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> no! 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 Good call. We should have bought 20 more of those. The last one we're gonna do comes with toys. The candy. I didn't actually get them for the candy. I mean, I bought them for the candy. Oh, gosh, they come with tiny little toys at the end of them, which I'm really excited about. This is One Piece. Any One Piece fans out there? Woo woo! Simon has no idea what I'm talking about. And this is I don't know what. I, I want like... the One Piece one. Oh, okay, good for you. Okay, good. Okay, first we're gonna eat the candy, and then we're gonna find out what we got as a toy. This is like a Kinder Egg, but cooler because it's Japan <laughs> version. Also, I've never seen Kinder Eggs in, in Japan. Because they have like toys everywhere. Like, like Kinder Egg tried to come to Japan and went down because of its like lameness. It's like, People are like a puzzle. Ooh. I got a little map. It's got a little like. Oh, really? Yeah. I think this is gum. Put it all in our mouth at once. I don't think it's gum. I think it might be like the taffy. Yeah, I think we should just try one because. I'm gonna um, do four at once. Why don't we do Kai Bai Bo and choose how many the pre pop to put in each other's mouths? Okay. Kai Bai Bo! Kai Bai Bo! Oh! <laughs> My rap strategy isn't working anymore! Oh, someone has caught on! How many are we putting in each other's mouth? Six is a good round number. I think that you were right. You know, it's the rear end at the bottom. Good, you know. Round at the top. Ooh, one, these all two, have green three. on the inside. Oh, mine doesn't. Mine has yellow on the inside. Oh. One, two, three, four, five. five. These are definitely not gum. You might break off your these jaw. These are trying really to eat hard. These. I'm just gonna have one. Oh, I'm a little concerned that you might actually hurt yourself eating these. Okay, ah. slow it down, big boy. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. These are really good. Oh. Uh -huh. What's on the inside? Poochie poochie? Oh! <laughs> Did any of the jellies burst out? No. Look. Oh. Mm. It's like bubble tea with her candy. Mmm. That is a really good system. Oh. I'm gonna open my glass. It tastes like Frutella. Fruit yeah. flavored chewing mm -hmm. with jellies on the inside. I want piece of Oh, my one piece size is a keychain. I got a little dude on a skateboard with stickers. Who did uh, you get? Flaming foot blonde guy. Flaming foot blonde guy. Oh no, his name is Made in China. Oh, I didn't know I got, him. I got Made in China right here. He's pretty good actually. Mm -hmm. These are really yummy. My jaw is so sore from and chewing. And his eating I'm just of my toys. You're gonna do no such thing. That's it for this week's food adventure. What is our conclusion awesome here? The chocolates are great. The candies are awesome. The chips aren't bad. And Mountain, Mountain Dew, Dew is horrendous. You stay this is, out of this. This is from like now on, this is like man. the McCall soda of Japan. Of junk food. This is terrible. But I almost feel like this must be a special edition. If you live in Japan or you're visiting Japan, you should probably pick these up and put them in a bowl and serve them to your friends. Yes. And have them be really sad and hate you forever. No, That's no, our no. conclusion. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no.
Mene, te quiero, Candy. Nana, manda, Banti. La, la. Let's talk about the training. <laughs>